Well, who is it? Shadow? Buddy! And just in time too, look at that. He saved Celeste, and he's here to push back the statue, or the Warring Tree Eyes. Push, push, push! That's right, you can beat that weakling Kefka. Kefka's got only magic, while Shadow's got massive strength. Yes, we have to go. Hurry up! What was the point of that, Setzer and party? Don't say that. Okay, I trust you. You can't escape me? What are you talking about? Holy crap. What's that? Is that our save point? Whatever. So yeah, we have to run away now. We have to get out of here. We have a time limit now. Six minutes. Yeah. And in our six minutes of running away, we have to fight these guys. The Nods, I think. In the Japanese version, or in the SNES version, they're actually called Naughty. They're just a, an enemy to keep you stalled away from running away. Because look at that, we lost like 20 seconds right there. Yeah. To be AP points, not bad. And no Gil, of course, since we're about to die here. Holy crap. Wow. Uh, there's no other way there, really. Don't worry, guys, since, you know, we're just going... Whoa, holy crap. Since we're just going... In one direction. There's no hidden paths to worry about, really. Alright. I'm gonna rearrange my setup here and give everyone a freaking Herbie Sandals to make the battles go by faster. Okay. Except Locke, since, you know, he's already fast. He's a thief. What do you expect? And of course, even though you're in the menu screen, the time still goes down. I mean, that's real life for you there. Hit. That's your special move there, Nod. Or Nani. Whatever, it's easy enough. I'm just gonna mash or hold down the A button to make it go by faster. Please don't be multi. Okay, you have to be multi target. Remember, these enemies here are just. are just there to stall our time. Oh, jeez. Yeah, well. You know what? Let me switch out to Kato Blepes. Whatever. Since Sister has only like one more spell to learn. And we get. 3 AP points at the end of each battle. That's pretty nice. Another nod or naughty. And a preemptive strike this time. Nice. Now let's finish this guy off for. Is that a woman by any chance? Because I mean. No, that's a clown. Like. A clown? I hate clowns. Not really. But man, like. Where's, where's the irony there? Like, Kefka's dressed like a clown. Holy crap. Cracks in the ground. Holy crap. One second away, we will have died. But anyway, Kefka's a clown, or he looks, or cross-dresses like a clown. And these enemies here that stall time are, well, clowns. Okay, don't worry about being frozen. Don't worry, we're still good. Still good. We have Block and Celeste, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. We don't need the bass for this one. Come on. Yeah, easy enough. I think I have, like, overpowered attacks, which is why I have, like, four minutes left. Now, over here... There's a treasure over there, but don't go to the right side like I'm about to. Really. But really, the treasure there isn't really worth it since it's just an elixir. You're supposed to go all around. If you go to the right, that path will break down and you will never be able to get back or get that treasure ever. EVER! Do I make myself clear, guys? Go down and away. Don't do what I do. Don't step there. See? Really, for me, I don't really care since that's just an elixir I'm pouring away. Yeah, there's no way across either. So you have to go all the way around like that. Oh, jeez, another battle. Eh, nothing to it. We have like three minutes remaining and like we're close to the airship anyway. Yeah. Throw some dirt to the sky. Come on. Really, is that like the best you can do, clown? I mean, you're here to stall time, really, but. Well, like, if you, if you can just, like, use a special attack called hit, like, that's not going to do anything. Save point. Or not. Alright, it's boss time. Yeah, the Narapa, Narapa, whatever. Mwahahaha, <laughs> you think I'm going to let you escape? Uh, yeah. Okay, the thing with this boss is that you have to be really quick here. Because he will cast Doom on all your characters. Just all the time. Can we get a turn here? 
The Doom is pretty much random at choice, but yeah, if it misses, he'll cast it over and over again. So yeah, it has to hit, or else you'll be stalling time more and more. And he has to reflect on, which I want to show you guys there. Whatever you do, do not cast fire spells on this guy since, you know, he absorbs magic, fire magic spells. So yeah, if you want to use magic spells, cast Reflect on the party and, you know, cast Blizzara or something off him. Yeah, I made that battle look easy, I yeah, know. Well, two minutes of spear, man, two minutes. No, no, don't jump off yet. Because right now, if you jump off, Shadow will die and you will never be able to recruit him ever again in the game. You will never ever see him again, ever, if you jump off right now. So let's just stand here and wait for the timer to go to zero first. But first off, I'm gonna, well, check to see how much, oh well, one more battle, I guess. We have plenty of time, really. Yeah, I, I mean, look, look at this, we're waiting for Shadow and like, I'm rearranging my setup and everything. You wouldn't do that in a situation now, would you, viewers? Yeah, I wouldn't think, I don't think so. Yeah, let's just get into a random battle with these clowns. You can't run away from these clowns or naughty or not guys. I forgot to mention, you just can't because they're here to stall time. Yeah. So I pretty much just want to finish this battle so Setzer can finally learn his death spell. All right, that's now officially all the spells Setzer has learned. We still gotta wait for Shadow. Yeah. If we come back like around maybe a minute and the third after to the airship, it's gonna say you gotta wait for Shadow, really. Yeah. Um, don't even bother. We're supposed to wait for Shadow, not look at our setup. Okay, one minute left. All we have to do now is just sit back and relax. Really, I could fast forward this thing, but really, be patient, guys. Like, we got 50 seconds remaining. Shadow will haunt your dreams if you don't wait for him there. But really, I want Shadow since, you know, he's really strong, you know, he's one of those ninja characters that you don't get very often, really. Uh. So yeah, how's everything going for you guys? Uh, it's good for me, I guess. I've been taking summer school, which is pretty much why there's been like a halt in videos. Uh. Countdown, you better get your ass here, Shadow. Ten. Nine, eight, seven, six, five. What was that? Shadow? Yeah, if you wait in time, uh, or if you wait for the last five seconds, the timer will disappear and Shadow will come. Let's get the hell out of here, guys. Let's get out of here, yeah. In the future, I will show what happens when Shadow, or what happens when you don't wait for Shadow. Holy crap, what the? Is that a save point? Where's it going? Is it going to the continent be below? What the? Whoa! Jeez! A piece of land up or the mountain was just lifted up. Holy crap. The planet's splitting apart. Whoa! Jeez! Oh, he just got squished right in there. Oh. An imp. It's panic time, guys. Run around in circles, back and forth, back and forth. Hang on to your underwear. Oh, man. Why? Oh, we're all dead. No. No. Oh, even Setzer died. And they died. Holy crap. Nuclear explosions? Is this the Cold War all over again? Or the fear of the Cold War, you know? Holy crap. Nuclear explosions. Tears in the ground, earthquakes, fire. Holy crap, the continent's splitting apart. Holy crap, the earth is destroyed. Kefka, 2012. Believe it. Ah, uh, my goodness. On that day, the world has changed forever. Well, guys, I guess I can officially say that this is the end for Let's Play Final Fantasy VI Advance. Yeah. I mean, look at that. Nuclear explosions, earthquakes, a rip in the airship. Our airship's gone. Like, everyone died. They all died. They all fell to their deaths. I mean, look at that. Even though we're Final Fantasy characters and even though that we can survive infinite deaths or death falls, 
We can't survive nuclear blasts. Look at that. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this very, very long Let's Play of Final Fantasy VI Advance. Quite a dis quite the depressing ending, really. It's pretty sad, really. Like, come on, Kefka won. The bad guys won. This is the Final Fantasy. The hero was supposed to win, but not in this Final Fantasy. Not in Final Fantasy VI Advance. Jeez, like, this is so depressing. I mean, the worst ending ever in an RPG game. Look at that. I guess I'll take a few days off to relax or get my, uh, well, get my tides back to the way they were. And I'll be starting a new LP next time then, guys, I guess. Maybe in a couple weeks after summer school is finished, but whatever. I'll think of a new LP to do in the future, and I hope you guys enjoyed this LP as much as I did. And this is Flashroom Double Zero signing off. Goodbye, guys. And see you guys next time.